good in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to build a free landing page for affiliate marketing. Affiliate marketing is the process in which you promote someone else's product or service and in turn you receive a commission whenever someone makes a purchase. For example, these are all different affiliate programs that you can quickly promote. And by the way, if you are planning to take affiliate marketing seriously, I would definitely recommend that you go onto affiliate.watch website as from there you'll find numerous affiliate programs that you can promote and you will also see the commission that these different programs pay out. So if you are not certain which affiliate program you'd like to promote, I would definitely recommend that you go onto their website and check it out. For example, you'll be able to see the commission as you can see right there. And you'll also be able to get different information about a particular program. Now, let's say for example, I will be promoting this affiliate product from Amazon. And with Amazon, you can quickly sign up to their affiliate program by going onto Amazon.com. And from there, you could scroll down and sign up to their affiliate program. Once you're signed up, you're going to get a top navigation bar right here. That you can get a link so if I were to tap on get link in the top left hand corner this is my affiliate link so if someone were to tap on this link then go onto Amazon within 24 hours and make a purchase even if it isn't the product that I'm promoting I will still be able to get a commission now onto the platform that we'll be using to create our landing page the platform I recommend you use is Wix the reason why I recommend Wix is it is free to use, beginner friendly and easy to understand. Plus, there are numerous tutorials that you can find on how to customize Wix websites to your liking. So you're going to go onto Wix.com, create an account. Once you have created your account using your email address, you're going to tap on create on Wix editor. After you have done that, you'll be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you're going to tap on set up without chat. Then you're going to go to the bottom right hand corner and you're going to tap on skip. After you have tapped on skip, you will be redirected to your dashboard. On the dashboard, you can give your website a name. So you're going to type in your website name right here. Then from there, you can tap on continue. You can select your site goals. So for example, I like to share knowledge, collect leads, then I'll tap on continue. After you have tapped on continue from here, the app that I recommend you use is blog. So you're going to select blog, then tap on continue, then select continue once more. After you have done that, you'll be redirected to your dashboard. Once on your dashboard, you could go over to the left hand menu option and select blog. From here, you could tap on create new post and you could create your first article. So let's say for example, I created an article using ChatGPT talking about the benefits of a projector compared to a television. So I'll simply copy and paste this article real quick. So the first thing I will do, I would add in the title. After I've added in the title right there, I can simply copy the body. So I'll copy the rest of the article and I'm going to paste it right here. After you have done that, all you'll need to do, you can simply adjust how it looks. So I could remove this section. Then from here, I could input the image. So I went onto Amazon and I simply copied or downloaded this image better yet. So I will tap on the plus here. Then I'm going to select image. After selecting image, I'm going to simply upload that image by tapping on upload media, then select upload from computer, and I'm going to be adding a picture. So you can see the picture is being processed right there. Once it has been processed, you're going to tap on add to page. So now that the picture has been added, I'm going to be adding an affiliate link to this pic. So if someone were to go onto the article, tap on the picture, they'll be redirected to my affiliate program. So I'm going to go onto Amazon, tap on get link, and I'm going to copy this link. Then I'm going to go back into Wix, and I'm going to tap on the link icon, and I'm going to paste the link right here, then tap on save. 
then you'll scroll down and you'll go through the article and you can paste the link at different places. For example, I could place it right at projectors right here by selecting the text, then tapping on the link icon and pasting in the link right there, then tap on save. You can also add it to different call to actions. Once you're finished, you're going to tap on save. Before doing that, let me select this right here. So you can select this and I'm going to change the style. So I'm going to make this a heading tool. So I'll change the style right here. So let me do that. You can see right there, it has now changed to a heading tool. After you have done that, you'll tap on publish. Once it has been published, you can simply close this. Then you're going to tap on setup in the top left hand corner. And you're going to tap on design site in the top right hand corner. Then tap on pick a template. Then I want you to tap on blank templates in the top right hand corner. And you're going to tap on start from scratch. So you're going to select edit. Once here you can close the pop up box. Then you can tap on got it right here. After you have done that, you're going to go over to the left hand menu option and you're going to tap on add elements. After tapping on add elements, you can see all of the different elements that you can quickly add. So the first element that we'll be adding will be a picture. So we are going to hover over image and we are going to select upload and import. And from there, you're going to tap on upload image. After you have done that, you can tap on upload from computer and you could upload an image or you could select an image that you had uploaded earlier. So for example, this projector, I'm going to upload the projector right there. Then I'm going to make it clickable again. So I'm going to tap on link. From here, you could redirect them to, you could redirect them to your blog post or you could tap on web address. Then from there, you could paste in your link. So I'm going to select web address. And I'm going to paste in the Amazon link once more, then tap on done. Then from there, you're going to simply scroll down. And after scrolling down, you can add a different element. So for example, I will tap on the plus again in the top left hand corner. And here I'm going to add text. So you can see the different text styles that you can add. And I'm going to be adding this text style, for example. So I'll simply drag and place it right here or I could place it on this side. So you can place it this side. And from here, you could add some information about the affiliate program that you're promoting. You could also add a button by tapping on add element once more. You could hover over a button. And then from there, you could add a call to action button like this one. So you could do that by dragging and placing it. It is as easy as that to place any element. Once you're finished, as you can see right here, I could also add on my article. So let's say I would like to add the article. I could tap on add sections. After tapping on add sections, from there you could add a blank section. So I could tap on blank section right here. After I've added a blank section, let's say you would like to add a snippet of the article. You could go over to the top left hand corner and from there you could tap on add elements. Then from there, you could type or tap on blog better yet. So you'll select blog. Then you can select recent blogs and you'll see it right there. Or you can select blog list or you can select blog list sidebar. You can see the different options. I'm going to be selecting blog list large and I'm going to drag and place it. So I'll place it right here. After I've placed it right there, you can see the article. Once everything is to your liking, all you'll need to do now is tap on publish in the top right hand corner and your website will be live. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.